Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Adrian, also known as Adria Rum. Hi. Today I'm filming a little apartment revamp part one. This is gonna be in two series because I'm still waiting for things to come in the mail. I still gotta figure some things out. I gotta paint some things. You'll see in this video. Basically, I'm just going through and tackling little tasks around the house that I've been meaning to get done. I'm doing an apartment revamp because I've lived in this apartment for like three years now and I love this apartment. It's just a little too small. I think if not this fall, maybe the next fall I will move. I really love my neighbors. I love my neighborhood. It's the perfect location. It's so safe. It's so quiet. And like everything I could possibly need is within walking distance, but it's a little small and I'm totally outgrowing it. I love change. Like growing up, I used to have like different themed rooms like every few years just because I was like growing and maturing and like my tastes were changing. So I'm just going to show you guys what I'm doing to kind of like revamp, redecorate a little bit, just to elevate it a bit, make it a little bit more mature and just to re-inspire me because I've been looking at the same background and you guys have been looking at the same backgrounds in my TikToks and in my instagram reels next week's video is going to be fashion week prep and then the week after that is going to be fashion week vlog yeah i love you guys and enjoy all right this is my gallery wall that i've had up like the whole time and i do like it i think it's really cute i just kind of want to like add like more dimension and texture i'm gonna put some pictures of like kind of what i'm thinking i'm so sick right now sorry if you can hear that i also have a task rabbit tomorrow coming to fill in all these holes i need to put something there i want to get new curtains i think i'm gonna take off all these pictures for when he comes i'm gonna like wash my walls today i don't know white walls get dirty so quickly like if you can see like there's just like scuffs and shit all over the walls i'm totally gonna wash my walls and like repaint and take all this down fill the holes like just have a fresh start but that'll be in part two also this is my famous filming wall i'm gonna take those dominoes and move them back to my bedroom i want to get a table here or a chair or something because i definitely want to redo like the filming wall I'm getting a new lamp i'll insert pictures i found this artist on etsy called Bespoke by Nikita. Um, it's an art studio that makes lampshades in India. And I messaged the girl and I was like, can you please make me a custom one? I saw this one and I was like, oh my god, this is going to look amazing hanging in the corner from where my disco ball used to be. Basically, I've been messaging back and forth with Lali, who runs this Etsy shop, and I asked her if I could get, like, this fringe, these colors, this texture, but on the spiky frame, so she's custom making it for me. Shout out to Lali. She's been so nice. You guys need to come check out this Etsy page if you are in the market for, like, a really cool, well-made, handmade lamp. Like, there are so many Victorian-style like i don't know these are so cool and there's so many different sizes and you can make them table lamps and you can customize them and like you guys they're so cool i'm actually obsessed that one is actually so sexy <laughs> i love that they included this video of them like hand making the lamps on their website this is not sponsored by the way I just like want to share the love because I think these are the coolest, most unique lamps and I've never seen this in someone's house. I also ordered this tiger print rug to go right here in my bedroom. Okay, you guys, the next thing I want to do is rearrange all my like clothing. So right now I have it like color coordinated although this got messed up but like my reds yellows and then greens and blues and then whites my browns and then in here is black i kind of want to just have like all my coats in here all my pants on the bottom all my tops on the top all my like light jackets in there you know what i mean so i'm gonna put on an episode of sex in the city and do that Alright you guys, I've made some progress. I have pants, 
longer shorts and shorter shorts so far i put up like four skirts i just don't have enough of these clippy hangers so i just ordered some on amazon and i like how this looks these are all my like long you guys i'm so tired and out of breath so sorry about my voice <laughs> these are all my long sleeves and it goes into short sleeves tanked tank tops and tube tops this is skirts and a few pairs of pants that need clippy hangers so like i said i ordered that these are my hats down here and i don't like having that down there but i literally don't have any other space for them because i do have a lot of hats and like all this stuff sticking out from underneath my bed is driving me crazy so i really want to get a what do you call it bed skirt to kind of like help hide some of the shit underneath here oh there's a bracelet that should go here i also have another one of these bracelet holders that needs to go that i need to install right there because this bracelet rack is getting full i do not like how these hats look i think that looks really kind of like frat boy vibes <laughs> so at some point i will be taking these down and hopefully putting like some art here i also there's a bug up there that dead bug has been squashed on my wall for a little longer than i'd like to admit so i need to fix that i want to redo my curtains again i want to redo my bedding because this is a mess oh yeah i got all my jackets in here and like i actually have room <laughs> by room i mean like that much to kind of like you know slide in between this is more room than i'm used to so yeah i have all of my jackets and like light jackets there i have all this room on this rack these are my dresses that i need to figure out where the heck to put them but i don't want to keep a lot of stuff on this rack right now because it keeps falling and it's like totally destroying my wall um like the rubber part of this like fell off so it's just like chipping the paint and like making this look horrible so i need to repaint this i need to get a new rod maybe tomorrow i'll go to the hardware store and get a new rod and then in this closet i put all of my winter coats this is like legit stuff to the motherfucking brim like there is absolutely no room in here but you know what? it's okay everything fits it's fine we're gonna keep it like that i think i'm just like overwhelmed with the amount of shit that I need to do. Alright, where are we? What are we doing? So we are waiting for someone which should show up anytime with a rug. But <laughs> nothing on the horizon. <laughs> <laughs> We're out here in the freezing cold. Facebook marketplace. Picking up a rug. I have the money in my sleeve like a little... We have the money. We have the money. Meet us here. I love Facebook Marketplace. Yeah, it's just late. Okay. Mission accomplished. Mission accomplished. Yay. Okay, you guys. We just got home. This is a brand new Turkish rug from Facebook Marketplace. It says it's 10 feet, so I'm hoping that it'll cover this entire hallway. Yeah, because I don't know. I have this pink rug here, but she's kind of gross and ratty, and I don't know. I'm just not vibing with her anymore. So... It's brand new, so I think I'm still gonna wash it. I just wanna roll it out and see what it looks like, so I'm gonna move all these shoes, roll out the rug, and show you guys what it looks like. Okay, you guys, I'm obsessed. It's so cute, it's so long, <laughs> and it doesn't really fit in the door, but like it's fine, right? so cute i think it just like adds more texture and divides up the space a little bit kind of makes the hallway look extra long too which i like okay i'm gonna put the boots back and i'll update you guys looks very good looks very nice and very good also you guys shout out to the perotin store i think i'm saying that right i had reached out to them it's a really cool bookstore on the lower east side i believe i reached out to them and was like hey i'm revamping my apartment like i'd love to get my hands on some coffee table books and they sent all these really sick ones over i need to go visit their store i've walked by it before and i was like wait that's so cool um which made me want to reach out to them because they had so many cool books that i saw even though i have a coffee table i need to revamp this area this table so i got this one from toilet paper which has some like pretty interesting <laughs> graphics but 
Anyways, I love this brand. I have my water bottle is by toilet paper. I got Eddie Martinez Inside Thoughts, which is just a bunch of really cool art. Love the pink cover. They also sent me this one, Claire Tabaret. Again, just a bunch of really cool art and like little blurbs about the pieces. I'm excited for that one as well. This one, Izumi Kato. I love how the pages are orange on the sides of both of these two. Oops. Yep. Just some photography, art, paintings. Super cool. Super obsessed. This artist is sick. So excited to read about this. And then Farhad Moshiri. Again, just more art. Which I think is going to be so fun. I think for now, I'm going to stack these three on my table. So this table is a work in progress. Also, it looks dirty, but it's just chipped. So I need to like, I don't know, figure out, maybe get some black nail polish and cover up all these chips. I just hate this table. But anyways, so I'm going to do three coffee table books. And then I'm going to get placemats for each side. I'm just going to have that sit there for now okay guys here's my game plan for today we're going to goodwill so i can look for a bowl for my coffee table or my table we're gonna go to housing works to see if i can find any wall art or a bowl and then we're gonna go to management office and get paint okay let's go you guys i got this new coat from Aritzia. I have this in a, like two other colors. Some about this like pearly pink. Shout out Aritzia. They just sent it. It's so warm. Okay, this is the Aaron's outfit. Adidas trackies. Aritzia puffer. Any wiki boots. It's actually not that cold out, but they're just comfy and cute and I got them. That's gonna be it, babes. That's the outfit. That's what we're doing. Take it or leave it. Okay. Swag money vision. I'm sweating. Let's go. Okay, I'm like running into all these thrift stores that I like never even knew about, but I'm kind of vibing. I found those three hats. So cute. Why do I need three blue flat brimmed hats? I don't, but I liked them and they're cute, so it's fine. <laughs> We're back home. I'm schwitzing. I know my period's coming because I got in a fight with a lady in line at the Ace Hardware store. No, listen, she was trying to cut me and I was very nice about it. I was like, oh, sorry, I actually think I was in line. I, listen, I was hot. I was sweaty. Normally I wouldn't care, but the line was so long and I just wanted to get out of there. So like, 
I was standing there and this girl like comes out of the aisle and just comes right in front of me and I was like oh actually so sorry like I I was I think the lines behind me and she was like I, I was here I was just looking at the knives and I was like I've been standing here for a minute I didn't see you you haven't been standing in line and like if you were looking at the knives you weren't in line and then she was like oh for god's sakes like if he wanted she was British. She was like, for God's sakes, like, I have m more important things to worry about in my life. If you want to go ahead, go ahead. Which, like, okay, fair. There are more important things. But, like, I'm, I'm ready to tussle. And that's how I know my period's coming. Also, I get, like, cystic acne on my jaw. And last night I was crying at 2 a.m. For no reason. So, for those reasons, I think I'm about to be menstruating. Anyways... You guys, I found a plant in my trash room. This is the most beautiful, I forget what this is called. I wanna say it's like a, it starts with a P? Comment down below if you know. Listen, I think there are a few rules in life. Don't pay for plants and don't pay for pets. Because like, someone was about to throw this away. And there's so many plants on Facebook Marketplace and like, people are trying to get rid of their plants. So like, go look there first before you spend like $40 on a plant somewhere, you know? It's so cute! This is my bamboo plant that I also rescued from the trash. I have like a spiritual connection to my plants, like I have to hug them every morning and talk to them. Wait, maybe I'll let one of you guys pick the name for my plant. Okay, comment down below. I like really nerdy names like Peabody, Edgar, Prudence, Reginald, Bartholomew, so... Help me out. Maybe eventually I'll hang it in my windowsill, but like, that's cute, right? I can still open the fridge. Okay, back to the haul. You guys, those thrift stores had like giant buckets of $6 hats, like all brand new. Look how cute this is. It's like Alden, ooh, I'm definitely getting my period. This one says Alden Electronics and it has like little gold like captain leaves on it. I don't know. I thought that was cute. Okay, and then this one, also blue, says Sesco, and it's a little more tight. <laughs> I don't know. It's just cool, you know? I don't know what Sesco is. I think it's a lighting company. Whatever. Okay, and then this one is Corduroy, and it says Holly Hill Construction. Bruh. Like... I'm sorry. So fucking sick. So I got three really cool unique hats for 18 bucks. Okay, next thing in my haul is a little paint tray with paint roller and handle. So I can bob the builder this shit. Also, my management said I had to come back on Monday to get the paint. So I wanted to paint in this video for you guys, but they're making me come back on Monday. And I gotta get this video up for you guys on Sunday. So it's okay. This is part one. We'll do it in part two. Not a prob. Not a prob. Next in my haul, mouse traps, because I'm pretty sure I still have mice. Next. Just like a little pencil tray because I have a bunch of loose pens that I need to put in a little tray. Let's go do that. Oh shit, I forgot I have this. It's like a solo wave light or whatever. And like, I guess you like put it on your face for like five, ten minutes a day and it's like supposed to help with like acne and wrinkles and stuff. I don't know, I don't have the patience for that. <laughs> LOL you guys, I swear. 95% of my time, if I'm not influencing, if I'm not like making content, is like <laughs> finding ways to like make my apartment more organized, genuinely. Or like cleaning. I feel like I'm always cleaning. Even though I'm like a very clean person, my apartment is just so small that it like gets dirty so quickly. So I'm always cleaning, always organizing, always like trying to improve the organization of my apartment because to me like a clean, organized, aesthetic apartment. Hold on, let me clean you guys for a second. It just like allows me to like think and like function properly and creatively. 
Because, like, if my place is messy, my brain is messy. Because I already have a messy brain. So, like, I need everything else to be clean so that I can exist in my messy brain. Does that make sense? <laughs> guys, I don't think you guys understand how happy this plant makes me. Like, wow. I'm going to give her a drink of water and let her drain a little bit here. Welcome home. Okay, my next order of business is remove these hats, put them in my van, take off the little hooks that are on this wall. My hat bin was overflowing, so I got this one, and I'm gonna stick this up there. I also went through in these hats. I'm going to be adding these pants to my depop rack i also got two bins so we can tackle my scarves 17 dollars for these new york is something else to tell you what okay so i have the two smaller bins and then i have this bigger bin that has my hats in it already so i'm thinking what if i put my scarves in the big one and then put my hats in the smaller one okay let's do that Honestly, I think that looks perfectly fine back there, underneath everything. Sir? Okay, I really want to take these wigs down because, like, what the fuck? Just too much clutter all around this place. Okay, next thing I want to do is replace this rod here. For now, this looks good. I'm glad that I have a rod that doesn't keep falling down. I just got a package from Smashbox in the mail. You guys want to open it with me? Today's been a long day, you guys. Smashbox Halo Sculpt and Glow Face Palette. Hey, what's inside? Oh, wow. Okay. What do we get? New Halo Sculpt and Glow Face Palette. Buildable and blendable, vegan, cruelty-free. Sculpting blush, shape, contour powder, glow, highlighting powder, and pop. Enhancing blush. Shop at Ulta. Shit, that's actually really nice. This one's a little more orangey and hot pink, I guess. This one's more like muted. Ooh, and then this one's a little deeper. Fun! Thank you, Smashbox. I'm blurry, but thank you. <laughs> Nobody from Smashbox is watching this, but thank you, Smashbox. Shout out Smashbox. All right, you guys, that wraps up this week's video. I hope you enjoyed. Part two will be like the icing on the cake. We're gonna be painting. Hopefully I'll have my new rug and my new lamp and new curtains, maybe some new gallery wall pieces. I need to find a bowl still. We gotta paint. So there's a lot that still needs to be done. But anyways, I love you guys so much. Again, thanks for watching. Thanks for commenting. You guys are the best. Take care. Love you so much. Ciao.